Hi friends, today I am going to present you the full in-depth review on this new Nokia Lumia 525 and I have already uploaded the unboxing and the hands-on where I have shown you the exterior design which is basically the same as the previous Lumia 520. The only hardware update Nokia has done on this 525 is the 1GB of RAM and the OS is also slightly upgraded Windows Phone 8 Black with some added features. The display as you know is 4 inches IPS LCD with 480 by 800 pixels resolution at 233 ppi and the viewing angles each and everything of this display is quite good for the price but not that much colorful as the clear black displays you get on higher range Lumia devices and also compared to the true IPS or the Super AMOLED displays this display falls short regarding the display color. But don't forget that the price of this smartphone is below 10,000 rupees that is 160 USD. Now on this Lumia 525, you can turn on the display by double tapping the screen just like Nokia's Asha series phones and this really makes sense because this is a touch screen phone and pressing the hardware power key feels quite annoying. The keys at the bottom of the display are also capacitive. At the top, you are getting both proximity and ambient light sensors, though still there is no front facing camera. The headphone port is at its right place and the volume rocker and the power key are just under the thumb and this is the camera key which is basically a two step key for autofocusing and you can launch the camera right away from your lock screen just by long pressing this key. I'll show you this camera interface later on which is quite interesting on this Lumia 525. There is nothing on the right and this camera is a 5 megapixels autofocus camera with HD recording at 30 fps. The secret behind the great look of Lumia 525 is the unibody like construction and the rubberized coating at the back cover which is also changeable to glossy yellow and orange back covers. The build quality of this smartphone is also great. It weighs around 124 gram which is also nice for a smartphone with these dimensions. Because of this very compact size, each and every corner of the smartphone is easily accessible with your thumb. Now here on this lock screen, you are getting your notifications of missed calls, messages and you cannot access them from here which is I think a drawback. If you swipe left, you will get your kids corner where you can allow few applications for your kids to play with which is a great feature of Windows phones. Now you must be familiar with the metro style design of Windows Phone 8 which is the simplest, fastest and the most user friendly interface for day to day life. There are very few customizations you can do here. You can swipe down to get the battery and your network status. You can get your all of your applications here and you can also pin any one of these to the home screen. I hope that you already know this type of simple interface tricks of Windows Phone 8 so I'm not going to show this. With the search icon at the bottom you can search anything on the web through the Bing search tool and this option is basically for the Bing vision which scans QR codes and Microsoft tags. If you press and hold the home button here you will get the voice assistant service from Microsoft which you can use for opening any application or any settings and also for calling, messaging, etc. Pressing and holding the back will bring you the running applications in the background and you can now kill these applications right from here. You can obviously open these applications just with a single tap. I have downloaded lots of games on this Lumia 525 and check the description below for the link of a hardcore gaming review. Well now I want to show you some important settings you should check on this Lumia 525. You can use this phone with your gloves on if you switch to this high sensitivity mode and you can check this option for the double tap to wake up gesture I have shown you though that eats up lots of battery life. There is another option called find my phone which will help you to locate, erase or lock your phone in case you lose it. Under the display settings, you will find this Lumia color profile where you can manually set the color temperature and the saturation for making text more readable and also for making images and videos look more colorful. You should also check this ease of access option where you can set the text size and you can switch to this high contrast mode which will make the text more prominent and remove the background images. You can also magnify this display by double tapping with two fingers. 
Another nice thing about Windows Phone is across all the smartphones ranging from 10,000 rupees to 50,000 rupees have the same interface and the same features. So this Lumia 525 has got the same feel and look of the premium 1020 or 1520. This people app here is basically the contacts menu but with lots of features, lots of options you cannot find on Android devices. You will get the social media updates of all of your contacts in a single page on a sorted manner. You can create private chat rooms with your family members and groups with your close friends. Overall this people app will meet your social needs for instance let's open a contact and you will get all the info ranging from the email id to the birthday and all of these infos are extracted from the online media you will get live status updates from facebook twitter etc so there is such a nice deep integration of social media on this smartphone you may not even need any separate application for those as this is a windows phone you are getting full featured word excel powerpoint etc the benefit of getting a windows phone from nokia is you are getting some premium and free services like this nokia music where you can listen to hundreds and thousands of free songs from all the genre across the world so you can listen to your favorite songs anywhere anytime this mix radio is another great feature here and according to Nokia these mixes are made by real human beings not by the software. So you are getting some custom made playlist of different categories under this Nokia music. These are the different type of categories of the mixes. So there are a lot of categories here. Under each and every mix you will get some more options and you can also download these that is you can make them available online just by pressing a hold. There is another very handy application pre-installed it's called my coach and as you can see this is for your better health and fitness. One of the main reasons to buy this Lumia 525 is its gaming capability. For the price you are getting excellent CPU, GPU and after the upgradation of the RAM to 1GB, almost all the games and applications on the Windows Phone store are now compatible with this Lumia 525. The number of games has also increased rapidly so for only 10,000 rupees you are getting a badass gaming phone. And with this Lumia 525 there is a great offer from Gameloft. You can download games worth 2025 rupees for free of cost. Another great feature of Windows Phone Store is you can try that is you can download the paid applications and games before you buy. So with this try option you can test all the premium and pricey applications without paying a single rupees which you cannot do on Android. The internal storage of this smartphone is 8GB which is also best in class. So if you are a gamer definitely get this device not only because of this great specs but also the option of downloading all the games and applications you get on the store. I have already uploaded a hardcore gaming review in this channel so check that out you can get the link in the description below and I started another channel called gadgets portal play where I show android and windows phone games and applications you can get that channel at youtube.com slash gadgets portal play. There is another nice application pre-installed it's called Xenio and this is an online magazine just like flipboard. There are lots of categories to choose from. Now you are getting this mobile friendly feeds of news, blogs, etc. Now guys let's concentrate on the camera features of this smartphone. This Nokia Smart Cam is an amazing camera software and there are lots of features, lots of options. First of all you have to just tap on the subject and click the shutter. The camera will now capture multiple images and you can get different type of effects. The first one is the best shot among all the images and the next one is the action shot which is applicable for fast moving objects. You are getting motion blur and change faces which helps you to get the best facial expression. Remove moving objects will remove any background disturbance from your subject. You can also change the camera to other modes like the Bing Vision is basically a QR code scanner and this camera 360 will bring a lot of effects, a lot of settings. 
you can swipe this shutter up and then just swipe on the screen to get different type of effects. You can get the same effects with double exposure. You can also move this wheel and get different type of themes or shooting modes and again move this shutter up and apply effects. There are a few more modes here for night shot and for macro and the last one is for taking portrait images. From here you can change the exposure value as well. This is some kind of filter. Now to get the best quality images you should use the original camera application and regarding the quality of the images from this camera, I will say this is good for the price. The low light handling is not excellent but with good lighting condition you will get decent quality images. The lack of camera flash is somewhat disappointing here. Now you can edit these images with the camera 360 effects I have shown you. The last thing I want to show you today is the browser and the browsing experience on this Lumia 525 is not bad. The display is good 4 inches with decent resolution and because of the 1GB RAM browsing feels very smooth you can open multiple tabs simultaneously without any lag or any kind of issue. This is the official website of Gadgets Portal that is gadgetsportal.in where you will find written reviews so check that out. Everything feels buttery smooth, there is no issue with this browser. The 3G connectivity on this smartphone is up to 21 Mbps and it has got Wi-Fi BGN. The Bluetooth is 4.0 and uh, you will also get 7GB of free storage on Microsoft SkyDrive. Let me also show you the keyboard which is kinda narrow and if you have large sized hand then you may find it slightly difficult. But it's all about practice and I'm not used to this that's why I'm not comfortable with this keyboard. But 4 inches display size is also not that small for typing. Well overall this Lumia 525 is an absolutely brilliant phone with amazing features and the look, the feel, the hardware, software, each and everything on this smartphone is extremely good. Because of this very simple interface there is basically no lag, hiccup or any kind of freezing problem on this Lumia 525 which is quite common on Android. Now last part not the least, the battery of this smartphone which is of 1430mAh is fairly decent, you will get at least 2 days on normal uses and 1.5 days on heavy uses which is more than most of the smartphones out there. The CPU is as you know dual core 1GHz premium Qualcomm Snapdragon S4 Pro and the GPU is decent Adreno 305. So this Lumia 525 is I think the best phone under 10,000 rupees and though the interface is not that much customizable as Android, regarding the quality of the hardware and the user experience I think this is a great phone to buy. Well that's all in this review guys, I hope that you have found it very helpful. So don't forget to subscribe and like this video, comment in the comment section and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching, bye bye and keep in touch.